Does making mistakes affect your performance in competition? I get asked this a lot. Hey, it's Coach Nye here with Mind Over Sport. Thanks for taking a minute with me today. And real quick here, we're, I'm just going to go over three ways to quickly rebound from your mistakes. Maybe you can refocus and be at your best for the rest of your competition when you do make mistakes. So possibly even one mistake turns into another and your performance just goes downhill from there. It happens to the best of us. Uh, the thought of that mistake or the consequences that that mistake that happened takes your focus away from performing in the moment or in the now as I call it. For example, making an early mistake in competition can create more doubts in your head and how you're going to perform the rest of that competition or a game. You must just say to yourself, I just don't have it today. It's one of those days. I'm going to make another mistake if I get out there. What you need to do and you need to remember is to unfocus that negative and refocus on the next play, the next routine, the next shot, whatever it is. The bigger or the more important the competition, the more likely you will follow up I mean, with a mistake and will even be more so costly if you continue to think about it. So during playoffs and championship games and getting back into a season now, you got to make sure the mistakes can take, uh, um, that don't, they don't take any additional a significance to how you're playing and how it challenges your composure. Since athletes will make many mistakes throughout their career, you've got to learn, as I mentioned, to refocus your attention and be present in the moment. Three things I like to cover from rebound, rebounding from mistakes. The ability to quickly calm yourself down. A quick calming strategy that helps you keep your emotions in check. Deep breathing is one method to calm the athlete's mind and body. Number two is self-talk. Use a phrase to move on, a cue, or some type of action that signals you to let go of that last moment. It could be just, gotta move on, or it's in the past, move on, something out of effect. And number three is the ability to refocus. Refocus is a, is a matter of changing your focus from the past to the present moment. Refocusing is the hallmark of a successful athlete. If you can learn these three components, and they can get a little deeper into each of them, and that's what we coach. We get a little deeper into each of those components. But if you can learn these three, you will respond better from mistakes. You can also try relaxation techniques. Cues again, focusing, refocusing strategies in practice. Determine what strategies work best for you, what feel comfortable and are effective, and then that will help your skills and your mindset in future training. So I hope these three components help you from re returning or overcoming some mistakes. Again, thanks for joining me here, at Mind Over Sport. Give me a give me an email, Coach and I at mindoversport.com. Or check out our website at www.mindoversport.ca. Remember to click the button below, like us, share us, and hopefully we will uh, join us again in our next uh, segment of Mind Over Sport. Again, remember, be determined out there and be the change that you want to be. Bye for now.